Look at this blue shimmer freaking kit. Friends, listen. Uh, maybe if, if, oh my graciousness, mahogany. Like, like I'm talking the real mahogany. Look at it. I think it's dated, friends. I'm not joking you. International sizes, right? So it just, yay, 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 yay. This is a, you know what I mean, friends? They, they, I mean, no one did chrome like these guys. Someone mentioned to me it back in the day when I was really into this is that their chrome was made in the same factory as Mercedes or something like that. Or, or do, do you know what I mean? In one of the car factories, the chrome process was the same. Like, Yeah, their chrome is ridiculous. It's dirty. It, it's one of my favorite drum sets. I'm, I'm just going to tell you right now. Now, if you're picking up drums, see, I like a hole in them because I can dampen the sound of the drum. I have a couple different ways I do that. Obviously, the simple way is stick a pillow in there. We've all, you know, but I want to show you the sound before. Check the sound of this freaking premier drum set. I believe it's about a 71 or 73, I forget. I think I think they're dated, but I'll double check on that. But I'm gonna put you in your stand here and I wanna share something with you, friends. I do, I wanna share something. Oh my goodness, look at that. Look, look, just look at this, friends. Ish, my, my buddy, Ish, I love you, buddy. Thank you so much. These are one of my favorite favorite axes okay they just are I, I in in my in my mind i wish they had a little bit more of a pull i i do just just to make it a better axe but yay it's nice it is splitting the firewood uh, in the tasmanian pattern uh, made in canada of course uh, you know what i'm saying uh, true temper um Oui, oui, uh, I have the people and I have the plan. Uh, yay, yay, yay. Beautiful. I'm going to throw that. So I had an axe. I only had one axe, right? Shiklank. See this axe right here? I forget who gave me this, but the people on this channel, I, I says, oh, I love the bluegrass uh, jerseys. And somebody sends me this freaking thing. This is a while ago now. So if this was you, thank you again. But I put it on a, a, a whiskey riv and it was, a, it was a pretty big handle. It was, was what I had at the time. And then of course the C30 came into my life. Um, but, but this ax head is about three and a half, three, three quarter pounds. And I am gonna tell you something right now, friends. This is, this is what I'm talking about right there. Yeah, that, that's what I want to do. Sorry, friends. Y you know what I mean? Y yeah, it just, oh dear heavens. So I, I was digging through my axes, friends. I made this handle from one of those blocks of hickory there. And I kind of used the C30 as a pattern, okay? I put the axe on top and I kind of used it, not totally, but partially. The C30 is still a little curvier than mine, but, but not, not that much. That's a hickory ay, ay, ay. plum. See? So I used that pattern and I scraped it out by hand out of a block of steel or, or wood, pardon me. And I'm going to tell you something. I really, really like this axe handle pattern. Jonesy makes a really nice axe handle. You've heard me talk about Jonesy. I know you're thinking about the drum set that I started talking about before I went off on the axe rant. Let's go back to the drums. Jonesy, we're going to work together in some capacity. 
We are. I'm thinking about, friends, I'm just going to ramble right now and I may send this video out. Uh, I tweaked my back. I'm just going to just gonna say it. I tweaked my back in the most silliest way that, and it's always that, right? It's that silly little thing you hear. And friends, I've been on the ball like mad and working out at Root Rot Running. Maybe I overdid it. I don't know. Maybe I set myself up. So I'm in the, I'm in the truck. And I go to look behind me. This is this is how it is. I've been in protection mode ever since I broke my back and hit by that tree. I've been in protection mode, and what that means is a, is a, is a is an engaged core. I walk around kind of like like engaged, fear mode of of injury, and it's been like that for 16 freaking years after I got hit. So, anyways, and this could be a good thing why this happened back there. I'm in the truck. I look. I think. Did I forget my gas jug? And I kind of turn back and I look a little further, a little further, and I hear this little, you know, the sound, right? That little feeling in your lower back and you go, oh, that's, that, that didn't feel right. Well, I worked because I went to Root Rots. I was on the way there and I kept working. And then the next day I was like, okay, I've, I've tweaked my back. I can feel it. And I haven't done that in a long, long time. Well, it's sore. So anyways, I'm kind of just, rolling through time here a little bit because you know how I feel about being injured yeah uh and it's not horrible but it is it's a fear that I could set myself up for worse so I just got to pull back for a couple of days and let this get it get a handle on itself so friends does anybody recognize that tool right there The tuxedo, uh, the tuxedo axe. This axe is, is as far as what everybody says is the complete opposite to what you want in an axe handle is what they say. Look at that friends sitting in the crack of the wood there in the floor. You, you, you basically want your wood to run this way. Well, this is a hundred percent wrong. It's a, I call it the leaf spring action. So the so the the, the grain runs this way, <clears throat> which acts like a leaf spring. <clears throat> Excuse me. And if there's no defect, you won't break it. Does this axe have a bit of run out? Well, it sure does have something. Have I have I used this axe? Oh dear heavens, have I used this axe? Have I broken it? No. Have I abused the, the, the wood? Hardly. Little scuff here and there. But I'm talking like, like hardly. And I have used this axe probably more than a lot of my axes. It's the gorilla, friends. It's the gorilla. The, look at it. The famous gorilla. Look at the splitting profile on it. Look at that. This axe is nuts. I want to recreate it. I want to recreate this axe. Okay. I need you to listen to something. And we're going to go over here. And you're going to have a little listen to this. I don't like being injured.
I'll show you the difference. When we push the dampening up against the front head. And what a guy can do, you'll still hear this. You can hear it already. Listen. Listen to the difference now. Hear that? More of a thud now. So now what you can do, I'll probably have to get down on my knees for this one. I got to be very careful, friends. I've, I've, I've hurt my back. Shucks. Now, let's do this. So we get... Okay. Okay, here we go. Daniel, son. Oh. Son of a gun! Okay. Check this out. There's the thud, right? sound do you like the first sound was like an open ballroom sound listen to that kick um sound people prefer the the muffle i i just a shot in the dark the 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 less overtone let's get rid of that that is a vintage by the way premier drum key and it is a cherished item of Buck and Billy Ray. So we'll put that right there. Isn't that, isn't that just wonderful?
You know what I mean? That, that's it's bang on. I like my bottom skin tighter than my top. So it's good. Now we'll just check. Yep. 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 Crazy, crazy. We just made this better by a couple little tweakeronis. That's it. There's the rattle right there. See that? It's gone. Huh? Gone? What did you say? Did you say gone? The rattle. Oh. Um, did we leave off with that Joe Pieweed that we're ripping out that tall thistle? Yeah. Moving that somewhere? Because I do like it, but it's not as personal for me. <clears throat> and putting Joe Pieweed where the thistle is? Uh, you mean the thistle? What's the thistle? That tall purple thing. It's got oh, little... up top there. Yeah. Should we put Joe Pieweed down? <clears throat> Let's have a look. Are you are you moving on that stuff now? No, you don't do it this time of year. Oh, okay. Are you gonna look anyway? Gardening time. Yeah. So, oh, <laughs> that sucker. Uh, I mean, it, it's been sitting for I don't know how long. Long, long, long time. Today's video was for our drummers and our axe friends. Just everybody. I, I like to get content out every day. But think about that for just a minute. Just think about that for just a second. I do my best, friends. Some days are better than others, and we just keep flowing it up. So uh, I enjoy seeing you folks every day, and I like to have something up. I've said it before. I just... I just believe in, in, in that part of YouTube, of being there every day. If not every day, close to it. So that's what I like to do, no matter what I'm doing. Did a little gardening today too. Friends, work hard, be honest, but most of all, be kind. Be kind to one another. I changed my thing on my, on my, uh, my chalkboard. It's been a while I've had up there is all you have is your name, which is very true in your work. And I'm talking to anybody, man, woman, and child. All you have is your name. And that is wherever you go. Every interaction could be at the drive-thru. If you step out of line at the drive-thru, people are going to say, hey, right? You, all you got is your name. And you will work hard. You'll work for 40 years. You work the first 40 years for your reputation. And then the next 40 years, your reputation works for you. I love that old saying. I've heard that for years and I love it. So here's the thing. If, you, if your life is, is there's a problem 
if you think that 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 you got a problem in your life, right? Oh, what does that say? Hey, how come that's backwards? Does that come up reading right, friends? Or is that just because I hope that comes up right. It says you are your problem. If you're wondering what that says, it looks backwards to me. Hopefully when it turns around, it'll be the right way. But it, it says you are your problem. I am my problem. I've always been my problem. This thing. But not, not that thing. That, never. My heart's never been my problem. It's been this thing. I'm going to leave you with that. In the next video, I'm going to finish off with one of my filing videos that I put a little one on Instagram. Hey, friends, here's a quick one. I don't promote my Instagram. Friends, if you're new here, I have an Instagram. Please go over and, and I guess, subscribe or check out my Instagram and follow me on Instagram. That's the word, follow. Follow me on Instagram. I put stuff on there. Let, let's, let's bump that Instagram up a little bit. It'd be good to see you over there. I'll see you on the next one, friends. Be kind to one another. Remember, I am my problem. Not you, not the world. Me, I am my problem. And you might be yours. See you on the next one.